So we kind of already finished our meal, but we had some smoked salmon, chorizo, and egg was what that was. And Arthur's having some instant noodles. Oh, wow. <laughs> Come in here. So what's the plan for today? Right. Anyways, this is what we look like when we wake up. Um, anyway, so what's the, what's the plan? We go to new territories, perhaps? Walk around? This is the first day in maybe two months that we've had off together where there's no work or any other kind of projects ongoing. So that's cool. <laughs> Arthur took a nap and I took a bath and now we're gonna go out to Campton to explore a new neighborhood. So I like doing that and so does Arthur. Yeah, We've made it to Cam Tin. It's really, really rustic and super cute. And there's supposed to be um, a walled village somewhere around here, so we're gonna go check that out. But first, Arthur needs to go pee. Cute little thing here. Look at this guy. Hello. I'm a peach. That place looks popular. So we're gonna go try it out. Oh, and they've got like a... There's a bubble tea place? Oh, herbal tea. There's like a cafe or something here. Oh, this is Cock Cock. This is the one I was talking about. Oh, we here. Do you want to try it? Do you want to have lunch? Yeah. All right, so our first stop is Cock Cock. It's from Boston. Yeah. How is it? Yeah. Very reasonably priced. We thought there could be a little bit more meat in it, but given the price, not bad at all. What you're gonna get, Arthur? My card's a uh, local band. This place is so cute, look at this. So cute. Very authentic. Look how popular it is. How is it? It's really yummy, it's still nice and warm. Such a cute vibe here. I said. Oh, a cute blue door. Arthur, being Arthur, managed to spill all over like the lower part of your leg like like honestly how it's not even it's not even that it's not even that full like it's it's like halfway how arthur ex expli ex explique me how i was walking with joy like this yeah, <laughs> okay oh how cute is this it's super cute it's like a warehouse Quilts, scented stuff, more cute stuff. Supreme. It's, oh my gosh, this just feels so cute. We found such a cute little nookie. It's got like all these like tables and, and stores and restaurants. So cute. Oh, I think I think We're in this super cute store that has all of this stuff. So we're trying the cheesecake in Arthur fashion. He's flipped it over because he doesn't like the cherries that are on top and is just eating the crust. I got some scones and we got this organic soybean, uh, which is very organic, but very yummy. Very, very yummy. How is it, Arthur? How are you feeling, Arthur? How are you feeling? So it's a little bit cold for Hong Kong standards. I'd say it's, it's like damn cold. It's yeah, like, it's like Vancouver cold. It's not Vancouver cold, but it's probably like five to eight degrees Celsius, and we're not really dressed for that kind of weather. But we're walking over to the walled city. 
uh, the walled village, so that's kind of exciting. We can see it here on the left. Hello, Wolf Wolf. That bitch, that, that, that bitch work. ignored us. That little bitch. Quite literally, because it's a female dog, get it? Ha 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 Arthur, do you see my parkour? Arthur? I want you to acknowledge my parkour. To say, I acknowledge your parkour, Dylan. Back off. Oh, that is cute. Little... Sure. There it is. See? Isn't it cute? We are currently not accepting visitors due to COVID 2019. Oh, bummer. Look at that. Oh, poop. Let's just take a peek inside. It's like a whole vibe. Yeah. We'll have to come back here sometime, won't we? Me too. It's going to be cool. Kind of brings you back in 1990. Yeah. Like 100 kind of vibes. Yeah. Okay. All right, let's call the driver, Barry. Okay, so there's two more things I want to do here. We're so gonna we go. Call our driver Barry. His, his name is Barry. Ari. Our driver's name is Barry. Is it? Arthur and I are neither successful enough to um, have a driver at this point. Yeah. And the driver, what, 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 what we call him? Theodore. Theodore. Okay, let's go find the treehouse. Let's go find Theodore. So we just found out that the next destination we're going to is 17 minutes away by walking. <laughs> Arthur, how do you feel about it? Oh, I'm in love with Dylan Smith. Therefore, I will do whatever he would like. <laughs> He's so silly. But yes, he will. I'll be using this as leverage. Ah, oh, fuck. Dude, seriously? Oh, yeah. <laughs> this isn't leverage. Oh, yes, it is. It definitely is leverage. Okay, I do this shit you want to do all the time. That's a lot. Exactly. Don't this use this different. as leverage. No, this is oh my god, that's such a cute aesthetic. Look at that. Love that, like the, the blue, the purple flowers. It's like a whole moment right there. That's a whole moment, right? 17 minutes and counting. Look, does that look like, like the... <laughs> no, it's so bad. But it kind of looks like we're in a... I don't know, I feel like there's a Japan vibe to this, don't you? You don't. Here's another cute little bridge. So it's like I just, it just feels like we're somewhere else. There's like a river. Look at this. Very, very Hong Kong. Don't you find this exciting? Here you can see it's a big temple. And there's like a little playground area beside it. So cute. Okay, so this tree is supposed to be somewhere around the corner. Where is it? Can we imagine if they tore down the tree to build this thing? <gasps> Ooh, that's super cute. Look at this. Okay, it's supposed to be, I think, around the corner here. Also, I mean, look at this alley. It just let's take a moment. It's so cute. Oh my gosh, my hair. Oh, here it is. So do you think of the tree? Do you like the tree? Do you think it was worth the walk? <laughs> Isn't this just a beautiful big tree? Can we get inside? Look at that. What a majestic tree. So this is the main reason we came to Campton. 
because I saw this tree online and it has this lake. We need to come look at it. I just love banyans. They're just such beautiful trees. And they say that if there are spirits that reside in a banyan tree, they're benevolent spirits. 